Uh, do that again. There's Abby. box on it and so obviously I opened it and it was coffee and it's coffee and it's Ran Ramon coffee central roasting coffee and it's got notes of chocolate orange and stone fruit in it and Jimmy sent that sent me this he did fantastic oh, he's, oh, he's a good egg isn't he he's there's a loads of it and it's for a dripper he's a good egg is Jimmy so he sent it to Leroy. Um, huh? It's for nothing. He sent it for um, your coffee is ethically produced and sourced in partnership with farmers and communities to provide a better quality coffee. Because he thinks I'll drink crap coffee. And I don't. By El Salvador. Nescafe Gold Blend. Semi washed. I don't want like, a half washed thing. But he also, I'm just going to annoy you. He also bought a stainless steel coffee filter for us. It says semi washed. He did say semi washed, yes. Is that what Jimmy does? He just semi washes. Oh, look, oh, do I need. He never washes his beard. I've got it, isn't it? I don't know how, how he even right, do this. Right, so look, come out the way. Shall I bring the camera over? No, just leave this one, just leave. There was little bits. So this, I don't, oh, you don't need a oh, filter for it. I presume this is just going to sit straight on top of the cap. cap. You haven't stood right in front of it. My cap is quite a large cap. Yeah, can we, oh, this is good. You surely got to put a paper cup in there? Because there's no point, it'll just go straight through it. Well, I don't think it will, because this is it, this is... There's... Can you see me through it? No? I can't see anyone. I would have thought... Oh, I, no, I can't see you. Oh, yeah, yeah, this little hole. Oh, very good, Jimmy. I like it. Yeah. But you don't need to pay the cup. Can I pay a... No, Doofus. I don't think so. But that... Oh, that's very good. That is going to come off. So I've got to be very careful. Right, I'm opening it. Okay, this is a video um, about coffee. Here's Abby, I'll just turn the camera around. Oh, just for us. Because it's not dirty, <sighs> semi dirty. Oh, that is nice. Mm. Oh, that was lovely. Oh. Strong coffee, that. Right, it does actually say how much to use. Simply, it's going to be the best co coffee you've ever tasted. But I do actually have a cafetiere, so. 
it should only be a tiny bit like that because there's not. Carefully don't knock it off. Yeah. Don't hold it. Oh, that's. Oh, listen. I'm coming forward for that action shot. Wow, what a magnificent gift. Would you not agree? Yeah. Look at that. Hmm. And all the things have gone right up there. And this was from Mason and White. It's a stainless steel coffee filter. It's just getting through at the moment. Uh, let me pop. One. Yeah, I'll do your little one. I'll put a bit more in because I think. wants to say hello as well. Right, let's pop it over here. It's obviously not made a full cup because it's we're going for more of the espresso. Let me just have a little look at this and see if that's possibly do with a bit more coffee in it actually. I think they should have um, given us a little thing about how to use it. But there's nothing. No, there was no instructions, was there? No. What, you mean on the actual yeah. filter thing? About how how much coffee and... Oh, I see. They're just presuming that you know how to use it. There's a wasp here. yours I think just have it black I mean I, I do drink black coffee a lot but you don't really drink black coffee you're not being rude are you no just taking strange shots Have a room. Smooth. Um, it's a bit smooth, actually. Oh, that's nice. I could drink that actually, just as it was. Yeah, I'm not a fan of black coffee, but that's actually all right. It's okay. I'd like to put some sugar and milk in it. To be fair, it's very smooth. Is 
Abby's a really coffee connoisseur. Any... She doesn't mess with her coffee. I can't get any hints of any... Hints of chocolate, hints of roses. Hints no, of I can't. Chocolate. No, it's just very deep. It's a very rich taste in the coffee. Very dark coffee. Hints of darkness, hints of roses. Yeah, it's, it's just, it's, it's espresso. There's not much of a, there's no aftertaste at all. No, it's not, actually it's not that bitter. You said bitter. Yeah. I can smell it being bitter. Yeah, it doesn't it's taste good. bitter. It's quite a sweet coffee. Mm. Yeah, I still want sugar and milk though. Be fair. Like it? That's very. That would be nice with like a mince dish. It's quite a heavy. It's a light, yet heavy. <laughs> it's it's a red meat coffee, isn't it? As opposed to a light coffee, um, which is chicken. I had no idea. I didn't realise there was so much in coffee. It's nice, though. You would have wanted to have that with a fish dish. It's better than, um, like, Aldi's own. Yes. Or, you know, like... Yes, so you, yeah, no, you don't be doing that. <laughs> I quite no, like... very um, nice. I like that. Thank you very much, Jimbo. I like strong coffee. Um, and that gold blend we've got out there is really nice. Yeah, that's what Actually, I like. Actually, it is really nice, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. It's very, very, very drinkable. Smooth, Actually, tasty. I like the little potty thing that it comes in. Not potty, obviously. Even black is alright, and I don't really just yeah, no. tend to like black coffee. And actually that, I know Jim doesn't like... It has got a sweet taste, you're right, yeah. Yeah, but Jimmy doesn't like cold coffee, but you could even make that into a um, frappuccino -y type thing, and that would be quite nice. Mm. But yeah, yeah, very, very nice. Thank you. Brilliant, brilliant yes, gift I will. from Jimbo, so... I'll have a little look into that company because I think there should have been a bit more um, details about how to percolate it yourself because there was nothing. So possibly I could have doubled up on the amount of coffee that I used. But then that, that packet wasn't really going to last very long. No. So. Bit of waste then. No, but then I suppose my well, coffee. You is probably could have poured more water through it. It's still well, no, because then it will make it a lot, lot less. Will make it weaker, yeah. Yeah, hmm. but this is just just what I think, and it's very very nice. So give me some coffee facts, facts for your viewers on coffee. Well, what you see, you're doing it again. <laughs> some coffee facts. No, I'm not going to give you coffee facts because that's very yeah. boring. For we want we want facts about coffee. Roll some facts across <laughs> the screen. Coffee was invented. All right, I'll give you facts about coffee across the screen. Yeah, I want facts. Columbia. <laughs> <laughs> Monkey bones. The mountains of Peru. Is that right? Yeah. Um, I want. I want to know everything there is about coffee. I want to know where it originated from, the time, dates. Right. Um, okay. And that guy who that was in Buffy the Vampire Slayer. Him. Oh, Anthony Head. Anthony Head. He yes. likes coffee. He likes gold blend. Yeah. Yes. See, I want to know stuff about Anthony Head as I well. I love Anthony Head. He was also in Doctor Who. Was he really? Yes, he played a quality. Yeah, that's what he's, he's, he's not famous for. He's famous for yes, coffee. Yes, he is. He is famous for doing that. No, he's not even famous for coffee. No, really. he's famous for being a... He was the main coffee well, He fan. made his name in coffee adverts. Yes, he did make his name in coffee. Like George yes. Clooney. Anyway. He, did he make his name in coffee? Yeah. Did he? He's in the coffee advert, isn't he? What, now? Yeah. Oh, is he? Nespresso, is it? I don't know. I've never seen it. Yeah, he's got a little cup and he wanders around. No, never seen it. Ladies swoon. Oh, I like Anthony Head. Always have done. Always will. Anyway, on that note, speak to you soon. Was that right? <coughs> Lovely, Lee. Oh, well, that was bollocks, really, wasn't it?